swimming around, this time out, you know, buying and selling jokes. I haven't on? really uh, evolved much, have I? Yeah. Um, it's a great film. Um, I mean, I was a massive fan of the original, and yeah. it's always great when someone takes a uh, film that is so popular and puts a fresh spin on it. And yeah. As we discuss that, I think there's a bit more colour in this one. I mean, what are your thoughts on it? Yeah, I think it's more, uh, it's more akin to Drive than the original pusher. It's less gritty, it's more stylized. Uh, and London is very vibrant, and uh, to me, it feels like uh, a living, breathing animal in this film, which I, I really like about it. Definitely. Also, I mean, the music as well is really intrinsic in the film. It drives the pace, it's got an organ sort of riding the soundtrack here. Yeah. Is that quite exciting as well, that, to have that element in the film as well? Yeah, absolutely. I think it's uh, like an extra character in the film that we have this thumping score, you know, that Orbital came and. Uh, provided for it's very exciting what were your first thoughts when you read the script i guess when you read the new adaptation um <clears throat> i thought it was very different to the original i haven't seen the original but i i you know i know it it's obviously it's an iconic movie i felt that it, this one was very um had a, a life of its own it was a very a different story about uh a, a very different frank i think and uh, a frank for london a frank for our time and you know, it, it was an excitingly ambiguous challenge to play Frank. And I mean, also, you're starring opposite Agnes Tina. I mean, sure. That's not a bad deal, is it? Working with the likes of Agnes <laughs> No, it's not a bad movie. deal. Uh, Agnes is great, and she has brought a real freshness and a vulnerability to the film. And I really feel that there are little stories the heart of the movie. And uh, I think, you know, it would be, it, it needs that. It's a very important uh, uh, component part. And have you seen the finished film yet? Yes, I saw it once. Uh, I saw it once in Edinburgh at the film festival. What are you most excited for the audience to see when it comes to this film? Well, I think that for me, I think it's that this is not your average common regard and East End drugs and guns story. I think it's a, it's a slightly different take on something that the audience might think they know what it's about. They, they, hopefully we've done something a bit different.